guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are in Nusa Penida, which is a 30 minute boat ride away from Bali. And we are gonna take you around exploring the island and show you everything you need to see and do and everything to know about Nusa Penida in 2024. <laughs> First stop of our day today is Crystal Bay. It is a little beach here that is known for its snorkeling. Sometimes you can see manta rays, turtles, and a bunch of fish. And the beach is super cool. It's a black sand beach, and there's lots of coral just washed up on the shore, so you know there's gonna be good coral in the water. And we didn't go snorkeling today, but we've heard it's amazing and definitely worth coming to visit. Just stopped back at our hotel for lunch. This is called Bing Tang Panita Resort, and we'll show more of it later. And the prices are actually super reasonable. Here we got chicken pom pom, and it was about 46 IDR, 46,000 IDR each. As David said, this is the Bing Tang Panita Hotel. It is located on the northwestern part of the island, and our hotel is a private little bungalow. We have a nice pool outside right outside of our door, also a pool in the front of the hotel with the restaurant, some nice lounging chairs, and a nice little private area on our patio to enjoy a coffee in the morning. And the funnest thing about this hotel is our bathroom. It does not have any windows, but it does have an open ceiling. So like we said, you can rent bikes to get around the island. One like this costs around 120,000 IDR, which is about $10 Canadian. And remember to drive on the left-hand side of the road. We made it to our next stop. This place is called the Chill Panita. It's a coffee beach club and we can't wait to go in and show you around. IDR each, so not a bad price. Three dollars maybe. Okay, we're still at the beach club. It's been a few hours, the sun's going down and we're getting hungry again, so we ordered food here and not a bad place to have dinner. The view of the ocean here and then the beautiful volcano behind us.
It's currently 7 in the morning, which is early for us, I know, and that's not very early. And today we're going to go to that famous beach, and Shay's going to tell you what it's called, because I can't pronounce it. It's called the Culling King Beach, I think, and it's the famous dinosaur rock that you see in all the famous Bali pictures. And there's a beach at the bottom, apparently it takes about an hour to climb down super steep stairs to get to the beach, so we're going to try to do that today and we'll see how it goes. We're up early because we're trying to beat the crowds. Apparently it gets very busy at this lookout point, so we're gonna see how it is. And that's the nice thing about staying on Nusa Penita. You can get a super early start and hopefully beat all the crowds. So come with us as we take you there, and then we also are gonna go check out Manta Point, see if we can see any manta rays swimming in the water from above. And this is a very special time to be visiting this beach because this might be the last time that there isn't a huge, ugly elevator on the beach, which they're apparently building now and lots of people are unhappy about. So we're excited to do it for real and climb down the stairs. We have made it to Kelling King Beach almost. We just parked the scooter. It costs like 50 cents to park it and there's no entrance fee to get to the viewpoint or the beach. So now we're just walking and waiting until we get there. And you can also already see they have a crane and they're starting to build the elevator. So it's really exciting that we're here before it's built because it'll be a nice fun challenge and we can say we did it naturally. So let's go. Now you guys know that we love our hikes, but when I see signs like this, it makes me question if we should do it. This is so cool. This is one of the places that actually looks way better and cooler in person than it does in photos. These stairs are no joke. This <laughs> is worse than the Great Wall of China. I'm going down like an old lady. <laughs> oh my goodness. The views though are incredible. Maybe halfway is good enough. It's about 8.30 right now and there's not that many people. There's still a few that tell you to stop so they can take pictures with their family. But I think this is way better than coming later in the day when all the day trippers would be here. So definitely recommend coming early. Okay, the stairs have ended. This is so cool, we just spot two manta rays in the water and we're almost halfway down. And we also recommend do not do this in flip flops, it would be awful. Yeah. Okay, we're slowly making our way down to the beach and uh, let me just say that elevator can't come soon enough. This is going to be way worse going up. <laughs> this beach better be worth it. My legs are like shaking. to a lot of nice beaches but I think this beats all of them so far. And the sand is the softest sand ever but wait till we start climbing back up and we'll let you know. <laughs> but it's super cool to see the manta rays and now we're gonna jump in this beautiful water.
Okay, it's currently 11.42 and we are about to start the hike back up the mountain. I just got destroyed by some waves. I even lost an earring. We would probably stay here all day if we could, but there's no restaurants or shops to like buy any food or water down here. So. And we didn't bring any food, but we brought water this time. <laughs> so we're gonna hike back up. Hopefully it's not as bad as the way down was. And we'll see you at the top. Hopefully. to the top, I have no idea what time it is. It's just absolutely horrendous. Like we were one of five people here when we were here at 8 a.m. and now there's about 300. And on that really sketchy part of the trail, no one is moving. And, and it's there's... so skinny, like you're like this close to each other yeah. when you're moving, trying to pass by each other, but we made it. Some people were very helpful on the trail and helping us, well at least helping me lift me up on the rock climb section. Yeah, and other people were very rude, literally just block blocking the trail to get a photo. So come early if you do come here. Okay, we just stopped on the side of the road. We're going to do another famous tourist attraction here called Manta Point. We just want to go to it and check it out and see if there's any manta rays. But I stopped because I saw the biggest spider I've ever seen in my life. And yes, I saw it just from the road. Check this out. I can't believe how big its web is. What do you think? I don't like it one bit. Okay, back on the scooter to Manta Point. Okay, we made it to Manta Cliff, and we're gonna walk down a little bit further to something called Manta Point. Sadly, no manta rays in the water, and the road here is the bumpiest road we've it's ever been horrible. on in our lives. Don't, I, yeah, don't recommend it. It's better for me, but Shay thinks it's really bumpy. It's like gravel mixed with broken, cement broken roads and now anyways yeah and now it's time to scare the parents here we go Guys, we made it to the actual Manta Point. It has a very nice paved road and there's these beautiful gates here that say Stairway to Heaven. So I don't know why the other one said it was Manta Point, but this is the real one, but sadly no manta rays right now. So Shay just told me it's called Stairway to Heaven because <laughs> you'll go right to heaven if you step too far off this. All right, so definitely come to the real manta point. We just saw four manta rays and two sea turtles and one monkey. Super cool. And you get awesome pictures next to the cool gate. And now back to the hotel. Good morning everyone, it's our last full day in Nusa Penita and today we are going to go to our favorite beach club, get some food and then go to another beach club for sunset because that's all we've been doing. So let's go.
Okay, we made it to the beach club. Now, some people might have a problem spending all day relaxing like this, but not us. This is what we were born to do. Okay, so that concludes our time at the Cactus Beach Club, and now we are gonna scoot on back to the hotel and then head back to Uluwatu tomorrow morning. <laughs>